Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Daisy B, and today I'm gonna be doing another get ready with me. But this time I'm gonna be answering questions, so it's a Q and A get ready with me. There you go. It's not a playlist get ready with me. It's a question get ready with me. I went on Instagram and I asked you guys to ask me questions on Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, what the fuck is he doing? Follow me now. Now. I fucking have a big ass fucking pimple. Mad as fuck. Like that shit came out of nowhere. Like. Alright guys, so now I am doing my base. So I'm gonna start answering questions. Um, let's see. Let's start from the beginning. All right. First question is embarrassing high school memory. All right, guys. Let's think. Mm, what's an embarrassing? Let's see. Oh, I okay. I got gotcha. So, my most embarrassing high school memory I, that comes to mind right now. I feel like it would be that one time I was taking a test in math class and I was fucking cheating and I had somebody else's paper but I had it underneath my paper like trying to cheat you know and the, my teacher was the type that was like would walk around during the test and you know like look at everybody's paper so I was kind of like multitasking like putting it away putting it back out you know like just you know basically trying to cheat and tell me why I like I guess I didn't like see him coming behind me so the teacher comes so the teacher comes behind me and then he like he like i guess he like noticed that i had two papers on my desk and he was like oh what is this and i was like oh like this is the test from like last time you know like i was like i don't know i was trying to just fucking come with a fucking i was trying to fucking come with an excuse because i did not want to believe that i just got caught fucking cheating i almost got caught cheating. i don't know he didn't like he didn't say shit like he didn't like you know like take my paper away and all that like because i guess he didn't realize that i was cheating but i i managed to cheat guys and i passed the test so. but i was about to get caught so all right the next question is what did you hate most about high school all right <sighs> the thing i hated most about high school and it comes to my real like real quick boy shut up i don't know why he keeps barking trying to interrupt me Anywho, <laughs> all right. The question is, what did you hate most about high school? The thing I hated most about high school would probably be um, the fact that you like come in the first year with a lot of friends, and you think that they're gonna be your friends till senior year, and then throughout the years you realize you don't really got no friends. You solo dolo. You know what I mean? Well, not really. You know, I still have my, my close friends. You know, my close friends were still my friends. But the other girls that I used to think that they were my friends, they're fucking fake-ass girls, fake-ass bitches. And you learn your lesson, you know? Like, not, not everybody's your friend, for real. And I feel like that's the thing that I hated most. Like, I don't know. And then I hated, honestly, like, I hated a lot of things about high school. Like, I feel like... Mm, I didn't get to experience it as I wanted to because I literally did not go. Bro, I swear to God, they did not let me go to prom. I was not even able to go to prom. And it's fucked up because, let me tell you guys, they didn't let me go to prom because, quote unquote, well, I was. They said that I was tagging in the school because I was fucking writing my YouTube like all around the walls. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> but I guess they caught me. They caught me and they were like, oh, like, why are you tagging around the school? And I was like, oops, sorry, you know, like, I'm just trying to get subscribers. I'm trying to promote my YouTube, you know? But anywho, um, they didn't let me go to YouTube because of that. They said that I was tagging. So I didn't go to prom. So I bought my dress for no reason. And I never even wore it. And that's so fucked up. Waste of money right there. All right, guys. So I put my eyelashes on off camera because I be struggling to put my eyelashes on. Now, okay, I put them on really quick today. But let's keep going with the questions. Your top five favorite songs. All right, well, it's gonna be hard, low key. So top five favorite songs, I would say. 
I like the song. Last, so I gotta be honest. Ask me for the telly, you know that I'm a run. Turned up like a warning, we put up on that dog shit. My next favorite song. No matter where I go, gotta take the heat. Even if that means I'm going to hell, they ain't take it. I got 24 my lows in that magazine. Just my fucking speaker's about to die. Anywho, that's my second. Next one. All right, that's my third. Now nah, let's go with the fourth. Trapper slash rapper slash bad bitch. Now she come out, baby mama mad. She said you live like a bitch. She saw what? Sold a hundred pounds and gave ten percent to the pastor. Church she going up the ladder. Hey, hey, hey man, make, make a man. Hey. Tell my son when I'm gone, you gonna be a rich little bastard. Yeah. All right, the last song I would say. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, so I think that'll be my fifth. But besides that, those will be my five top five What? Those will be my top five favorite songs at the moment. Alright, the next question is what is something you wish you would have done differently in the past year? Alright, that's some deep shit. Um let's see. I probably it would probably be like that like I wish I was like more organized and like I did everything like when it was supposed to be done and not do everything like last minute, you know what I mean? Cuz then I'm I'm the type that I tend to like do everything last minute, like and then like once I get everything like all bunched up and then I start stressing out. Like during my school year, my senior year, honestly, I did everything last minute and that fucked me up like i was about to not graduate because my grades were bad so i had to get all my shit like last minute and i had like what like a month or less than a month to get my grades together so i could be able to graduate and you know it kind of was stressful because i was doing everything last minute like i said i didn't do everything like when i was supposed to so you know i had to deal with the consequences and do everything last minute so i was kind of pressured like throughout the year because I was like fuck I gotta graduate so I was all pressured like trying to like do my work last minute and everything and it was just like that's like something I wish I did differently like I wish I did like I, I don't know how to say it. like I, I wish I was more organized with myself and I feel like I wouldn't have to deal with all the stress I had to deal with you know like I would avoid all that stress but you know you live and you learn you know now I know but yeah that's something I give you guys advice on that too like Especially on your senior year, I feel like you need to be organized. That's like step number one, like for real. Cause then you stress the fuck out if you don't. Because look at me, but I still graduated though, so I'm chilling. Next question is, do you miss school? All right, let's see, let's see. So let me be. I fucking honestly, like I was just saying. I did everything last minute. I did everything last minute. So I was very stressed out throughout the year, you know? And I feel like at the moment while that was happening, I was kind of like, oh my God, like I cannot wait till I get done with high school. I'm so over it. Like that's how I felt. Like I was just like, oh my God, like I'm so tired of high school. I just want to graduate and leave, you know? But, you know, now that I graduated and like, you know, it's been like a couple weeks without school. I'm kind of like, I do miss it, you know? Obviously, I'm gonna miss it because that's what, like, honestly, school. What the fuck? Where's my brush? Oh, um, school, I feel like school, it's fun, but like, only like, because I would see my friends so much. Like, I would see my friends like for a whole week straight, you know? And like now, now that we don't have school, like, I don't really see them as much. And I feel like that's what's hitting me, you know? like. That I don't really see them as much so it's like that's kind of like the only thing that sucks probably and I'm kind of it sucks because I did not get to experience my prom or like none of the senior fucking field trips I didn't have no fucking field trip this whole senior year I didn't go to no field trip and that's fucked up like you give me like I don't know like I feel like I wasn't really like feeling the senior year 
Somebody said, what would you say motivated you to strive for your goal? I feel like what motivated me would be like that I just kept thinking to myself, I'm the only motivation I have, you know? Like I only have me, you know? I don't think I should have I don't think I need somebody else to be telling me, oh, do this, do this, do this. You know, I have to obviously motivate myself. And I feel like that's what got me throughout the year, you know, like, just, you gotta motivate yourself. That's, you all you, like, you're all you have. Like, dead ass, you are all you have sometimes. And you gotta, like, just make the best out of it, you know? I don't know. But I feel like that's what motive. like, I don't know. Just getting the year over with, that's what motivated me. Just graduating it gra what graduating and just you know all those those four years of fucking high school just getting them over with like that ass um best pickup line you've he ever heard nobody has ever used a pickup line on me probably like on messages but like in person never but the best one i've heard probably Roses are red, violets are blue. What? I cannot fucking speak blue. What? Violets are red? No, wait, violets are not red. It was at this moment that he knew bitch. he fucked up. <laughs> violets are red. Man, no, shut your bitch Roses are red, up. violets are blue. Hot Girl Summer is right here and you should join too. Ash, what is your favorite artist? Or your top three. Uh, my favorite artist would probably be G Herbo. Like, I always say this. G Herbo is just goaded as fuck. Like, he never disappoints. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. He never disappoints. Like, never. But my top three, probably G Herbo. Um, I'm going to just put, like, rappers. I'm going to just say rappers. G Herbo. Um, Kodak Black. Um... Lil Durk, I'm not gonna lie, Lil Durk. I've been listening to him, like his music, he's not like, he's going crazy, I'm not gonna lie. What's your purpose of living? Oilo? Um, my purpose of living is, there's no purpose, I'm just here. I'm just here. All right guys, so that is all the questions I got on Instagram, so I'm kind of basically done for my part. Um. My makeup, I'm kind of, I'm literally done. I just need to do my hair and change. I don't think I'm going to do my hair, like, anything special to my hair, honestly. I don't know. I've been trying not to use heat on my hair because the heat damage, I don't want fucking, I don't want to fucking damage it so much, you know? We're going to be making some pizza. Making pizza with me and me. Then we're going to be making spring rolls. Um, that shit's really viral on TikTok. So I'm gonna try it out. You're gonna be gentle with it, right? Oh, they're already broken. And I gotta always from the bag. Like, you was like, no one touched it. Well, they're all broken. Yeah. Ta da! Go ahead. You go back. So, yeah, guys, I'll see you guys if I do see you guys. If not, I'm glad you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys whenever I see you guys. Um, yeah. Bye. This here. Uh, we're gonna test it, taste yeah, it. Wait, I need some green. Tell me it's good. Tell me it's good. I need some green. Wait, hold up. <laughs> Wait, I need some green. Tell me it's good. 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 Tell me it's good